Hey friends, it's Takadiris. I'm in a studio right now about to get my makeup done today from one of my favorite manga ever, and I'm sure one that is beloved by everyone, and it is Junji Ito's Uzumaki. Actually, happenstance, completely by accident, I just happened to just choose like a spiral t-shirt. I guess I was just feeling the vibes today, but if you haven't seen Uzumaki, if you haven't read it, definitely go do it because there's a very iconic scene that is still ingrained in my brain today where when you turn it, there's a girl with her eyeball somewhat spiral spiraling into like this dimension that seems to be fused into her face. I always wanted to do that look, but it just seemed like really complex and I'm not very good at makeup. So today I'm in this studio and I'm about to get my makeup done by this lovely gentleman over here. This is Jiro. Hi, Hi. Nice, to meet you. nice to meet you. Uzumaki Meiko no ichiban daiji na main part no Uzumaki. Wow, that looks exactly <laughs> like the one. Kochi, yeah. kochi desu ka? This. But I think first we're gonna actually look around his uh, studio because I was coming up here and his studio looks so cool. So we're gonna actually do just a little bit of a tour of that first before we get into the good stuff. So let's go. I'm just saying that this elevator is like something I would see like in a zombie apocalypse. Like, <laughs> zombie. If I'm gonna like get killed, this is like the perfect place to hide. Oh, yeah. wow. That is my body paint. What? Body paint? Yes. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> wow. For movies, I assume? For movie and a TV program oh. and an event. Yo, check this out. He made an attack on Titan mask. Oh my really? gosh. And these, uh, you know? Oh yeah, Venom. Yeah, Venom and uh, uh, Carnage. Wow. Mm. What's going on with this one? This one is for movie. Whoa. Oh, broken. Eh? <laughs> Finger. Eh? Is that, is Disney that... Plus, ano kono ega ga arimasu. Drama, yeah. so Disney, was... what are you doing? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> no, it's getting yeah. more edgy. <laughs> oh, he's gonna let me try on a mask. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Oh wow. Let's try this. Yes. Oh, yeah, just yeah. oh, just here. Oh, okay. Yeah. This is... Wow. How's it look? It's good. Dude, this guy is so skilled. Oh my gosh. Oh, hold on, let me try this. This is some... It's good for Zoom. I know. Hey, oh yeah, if I'm in like a Zoom call, a bi like a business call, just being like, oh. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh my gosh, I'm just like blown away. Like each and every project, there's like so much detail to it and I'm about to be somewhat a part of it with this video by turning into Junji Ito. This is really cool. Oh, these are all the movies too that you Movie and the commercial. Oh, com oh commercials? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. How big is this? It's, uh, three meters. Three meters? Yeah. I'm American, what does that mean? Oh, wait. It <laughs> Did you make a mask? No, of the Money Queen. Oh, a mannequin. Yeah. Ah, okay. I was a bit, I was wondering what this one was about. <laughs> wow. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah. yeah there's Kerry Pommy Pommy. So this guy's done like a lot of work. Wow. So we're just down one more floor, and this is just another studio where people start making where all the magic happens. Right now, I guess that they're making some armor. So we're actually gonna go upstairs to the school area where he teaches his pupils that also want to get into the same profession. So let's go check that out. <laughs> Everyone's making like their own armor right now and so far from what I can see oh man can they make my cosplays one day? <laughs> can yeah, yeah, I yeah. pay them to make my cosplays? These are so good. <laughs> I could commission some at some point. Can I get like berserk at some point? <laughs> you know? Oh wow. These are also by your students? Yes. Oh wow! It's like the like underwater octopus. Yeah, yeah, octopus. This is where I'm gonna be getting my makeover done. Um, I think that he said it's gonna take roughly like maybe three or five hours, somewhere around there, if we're lucky. Um, but it's gonna be a long day. I'm excited though. I'm really excited. There were two characters I always wanted to do, either Tomia or the Uzumaki one, and I really wanted to do the Uzumaki one. Tomia has like the second head that's attached to her, which is great, but I feel like today I want to just finally just do Uzumaki. Also on my Instagram, I already did Tomia, but that was just on Photoshop, so maybe in the future. Oh, cool, he's got like also some pipes here for me to smoke. Oh, he is so accommodating. 
just kidding now. I, I'm not funny. Alrighty, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just sit here. Okay, goodbye. First is we're gonna do the hair. She's gonna try to style it so we get that like bob cut that the character in the manga also has. The other thing that he told me was that um because I have kind of like a little bit of a mochi shaped face. Um, she has a very sharp jawline, so they're also gonna like paint my jaw to be more like precise. I brought my one of my more favorite Junji Ito books with me. Look at this, this is, this is a big one. This is all one story. It's called No Longer Human. Um, would really recommend this. I, I realize not a lot of people talk about this one. Like obviously we've got like Pomian, we've got like Uzumaki, but not a lot of people talk about this. And so I brought it here just to like show off to you guys. Also, I'm pretty stoked for the new Junji Ito anime. It looks so good. Comment down below if you guys are also excited like I am. First step, we're gonna turn my face white. Should give us like kind of like the good manga white. And lucky enough, we're actually in a white studio too. So any photos that we take is gonna look pretty good for like that manga effect, hopefully. To mid time. <laughs> Oh, that is so cold. <laughs> it's not, it was just pure white. Oh, wow, that is all over my contact. Yeah. Oh, oh you have contact. You know, it's like when you walk into a really thick fog. Like, that's what I'm seeing right now. It looks so creepy. Already? Already? <laughs> okay, so this is the first, second, I don't know what phase we're on, but you guys can see. So we've got a lot of the face makeup done. I had to put my contact in, so there's a little bit of makeup that I got off, but I'm sure they're gonna cover that. Uh, this part they're not painting, which is great because my piercing's here. Um, and so they're gonna put like that big piece of paper that Jiro made. And then I think the last part will probably be the hair and then we'll be able to do some photo shoots, but we're making pretty good time. It's been about like an hour since we started and uh, yeah, they, did, they want to give me like an even sharper jawline. So he painted like all of this black. We're just having a little break right now. I look like a mime. Uh, yeah, it's mime. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, so I can't stop looking at it. <laughs> it's freaking out. Holy so, so shit, it looks so real. I haven't seen myself yet, but how do I look? How do you can't look It's actually. creepy. The Nengu looks like there's a freaking hole in your head. That's awesome. Wait, yeah. let me look. Okay. Wait. Whoa, okay. Whoa, that's freaky. I don't know what you guys are seeing, but I'm sure it looks awesome. I just took a bunch of photos of myself, and I'm sure that the illusion based off of everyone's reaction is perfect. So this is all thanks to the magical hands of Amazing Jiro and I think that he lives up to his name of being Amazing Jiro. So <laughs> thank you so much for turning me into Uzumaki from Junji Ito. Guys feel free to go follow him on Instagram and also follow his website. I'll link everything in the description below but I'll let you guys see a couple more like b-rolls of this before we sign off but I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Subscribe to my channel for more content and I'll see you guys guys in the next video. Bye! Bye. Oh, so he just gave me his art book and he signed it as well. Also, he gave me uh, the eye, which I just put it in here. I'll just keep it in there for safekeeping. But check this out. This is some of his work again.
You guys can go follow him on Instagram if you guys want to see some of his work. <laughs> this. I have like a little book that I keep like little, like all the cool collabs that I do. I always take something, oh, yeah. Yeah, like a photo or something, but this is like better, I think. <laughs>